Good day everyone. Today I would like to share to you one of the most loved verse in the book of Isaiah chapter 40 verse 30 to 31. As we read it in the ESB and it says that even the youths shall faint and be weary, a young men shall fall exhausted, but they who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles, they shall run and not be weary, they shall walk and not be faint. These wonderful verses here were first addressed to the people of God who are exiled in Babylon. As an exile and captive in Babylon, they undergone a lot of cruelty under, under the hand of the Babylonians. Marami po silang naranasang mga hirap, mga pasakit, and so therefore, as they look upon the Lord, as they look and wait to the promise of God, because God promised them that there will be a time for the promise of God for them to be able to go back to Jerusalem in their homeland. But as they wait for that, these two verses here are wonderful promise of God to His people and even to us right now in the midst of this COVID pandemic na nararanasan po natin. There are two things na makikita po natin dito. Fact, realities. No? That if we are going to examine this verse, the first is in verse 30 where one reality that we can see here is that we cannot rely on our own strength. And sabi po dito, kahit ang mga kabataan, nanghihina at nalulupay pa din. The truth is, human strength at its best, we cannot rely to it because inevitably, human strength fails and only the promise of God can sustain us. But the good news is, if we cannot rely on our own strength, because definitely magigib in din tayo, gigib up din tayo, million times in our mind, the good thing is, we can rely completely on God's strength who sustained us in the midst of our difficulties, just like the people of Israel. Sabi po doon sa verse 31, Those who hope upon the Lord, those who wait upon the Lord, shall renew their strength. The word renew, it means that you find endless supplies of fresh strength you find endless supply of fresh strength. So it means as God's people wait upon the Lord, as they suffer, as they agonize, they will find unlimited fresh strength that comes from the Lord. Sa atin po, ganoon din. I believe during this time of crisis, as we feel restless in this situation already, at hindi natin alam kung kailan po ito matatapos, as we battle on this every day, we, as we people of God, wait upon the time that God will put an end to this. Or as we wait upon the time that God will completely fulfill His promise. It's like yung muling pagbabalik ng Panginoon, yung pagkuha ng Panginoon sa kanyang manilang palataya. In whatever ordeal we have, in whatever difficulties we have right now, now or in the future, this is a wonderful promise of God that we will find as we hope upon the Lord, He will renew our strength, which means as we wait upon the Lord, as we hope upon the Lord for His perfect time, we will find unlimited supply of fresh strength that comes from Him. I hope today you will find God's strength in your life, whatever it is that you are struggling with, whatever it is, ano man yung sitwasyon na meron ka ngayon, may you find God's strength, fresh strength that comes from the Lord, unlimited as it is. So we don't rely on our own strength, but we rely on His strength, on God's promises. God bless everyone.
clothed in majesty. Let all the earth rejoice, all the earth rejoice. He wraps himself in light, and darkness tries to hide. The trembles at his voice. Trembles at his voice. How great is our God? Sing with me. How great is our God? And all will see how great, how great is our God. Oh, 
is an awesome God He reigns From heaven above He reigns The power and love our God is an awesome God Our God is an awesome God He reigns From heaven above He reigns The power and love our God is an awesome God Our God is an awesome God He reigns from heaven above it is The power and love of God is an awesome God Our God is an awesome God Our God is an awesome God